I'm Ray. I'm 84 years old. Where, where am I going? I only started performing uh, when I was 72. Oh, there you are. I got, I got lost. My biggest supporter is my wife. We met at a university extension class in 1980. I love writing about romance, whether it's love gained or love lost. And uh, I want to show America that you can have talent at 94, 104, whatever. Just by being not alive. Hello, is this working? Yeah, I guess it's it is. It's working. We can hear you. Fantastic. Can okay. you hear me? Mm? Can you hear me? Can you yes. hear me? That answers your question. <laughs> we could go on all night like this. Yes. You want to? Yeah, I, I would be great. <laughs> what is your name? My name is Ray Jessel. Would you share with us your age? Is My that rude age, of me to I, ask? I've got plenty to share. <laughs> 84. I'm 84. Wow. Wow. <laughs> 84. Are you excited to be here? I've never performed before judges before. Um, I've appeared before judges before. <laughs> Ray, what will you be doing for us today? Uh, a song I've written. Can't wait to hear it. All righty. Thank you. What am I doing wrong here? Yeah. Oh. Thank you, sir. Very good. That's wonderful. Okay. And for my second song, I'd like to... Uh... <laughs> I met this girl. And she's just great. This girl I just adore. The problem is... She has much more than I had bargained for. She's got that style. She's got that smile. She's got the walk. She's got the talk. She's got that zing. There's just one thing. She's got a penis. <laughs> She's got that flair, knows what to wear. She's got that face, that girlish grace. She's got pizzazz, too bad she has a penis. <laughs> now there's always some failure, always some flaw. Ain't that what they call Murphy's Law? But male genitalia, that's where I draw the line. Besides, hers is bigger than mine. <laughs> My life's a mess, cause under that dress, she's got a P E N I S. Yes. Thank you very much. Great job, Ray. Thank you very much. Ray. Yes. So, Ray, you... <clears throat> so you wrote the song, you said, yes. right? Yes, yes. Did that happen to you? <laughs> Is this a true story and you turn it into a song? Well, actually, something like that happened to a friend of mine. A friend oh. of mine. Oh. Oh, I know those friend of mine things, but this is true, actually. Uh, um, you anyway. have no idea what you just did in what? my house. My children are all sitting in the audience, and they all will be singing that song later on tomorrow, <laughs> the next day, the day after. You have no idea. It is a very catchy uh, tune, but I tell them not to say that. It's a catchy tune. I like to write word. catchy tunes. They don't write them like that anymore. Uh, can I tell you something? You know, I'm really thinking you're a breath of fresh air well, at 84 thank you. years old. Thank you. When you first got up, I was kind of like, oh, this is one of those acts that are a waste of time. I was going to buzz you. And, this, and then all of a sudden, you kicked in with that brilliant lyric. <laughs> and, and you know what? <laughs> Good for you. You know, but, we, we, but, you hear 84-year-old guy, you think 84-year-old guys have lost their sense of humor. You've got it in spades. You're doing no, terrific some of them audition. have lost everything. So, Fantastic. You know. <laughs> right. Some even at an earlier age. Yeah, absolutely. Mel B. Ray. You are a naughty, funny, dirty old oh, man. Oh, thank you. 
Thank you, dear. And I loved it. Made me laugh a Thank, lot. Thank you. We need more laughter. Howie, you were up on your feet. I love it. Yeah. I'll tell you something. You're funny and witty and personable, and I just, I can't see enough of you. I love you, Mr. Jessel. Thank you so much. Let's start the vote. Howie, I'm going to start with you. Yes. Hell. No. Yes. Ray, I'm going to give you a yes as well. That's three yeses. And I'm going to give you four yeses. Four yeses.